Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for May 24th of 2023. Well, it is titled Observatory Aligned with Moon Occulting Jupiter. So what do we see here? Well, this is the very end of the occultation of the planet Jupiter by our moon. And you can see a portion of the moon below the horizon at the observatory here. And it's very thin crescent. Now the dark portion of the moon kind of leaps wraps around there and goes very close to that very bright object in the sky. And that is the planet Jupiter. So slightly before this time Jupiter was being blocked out by the moon and that's what we call an occultation when one object passes in front of another and blocks out its light. A common example of that is what is also known as an eclipse when our moon passes in front of the sun blocking out its light. An occultation can occur with the moon, which is quite common because of the moon's relatively large size. But you can also have planets occulting each other or planets occulting stars and blocking out their lights. Now, while they don't occur every day, they are not super rare and do occur and are used to be able to study some of the objects. So how Jupiter is blocked out by our moon and how it reappears can tell us something about the structure of the planet itself. And that was very useful, especially before the era of spacecraft, when we could not travel out to Jupiter to look at it and had to depend on studying things from, from Earth. And it was a way to study the atmosphere spheres of these objects. Now this occurred earlier this this month so relatively recent occurrence and we can find and we've seen images of many other occultations and conjunctions when objects are just close together in the sky but may not directly pass in front of it. Now the observatory here is what is known as Lick Observatory in California and is a famous observatory and in fact is responsible for the discovery of one of the moons of Jupiter and that is the one known as Amalthea and that was the last of the moons of Jupiter that was detected visually and what that means it is the last of the moons that by just looking through a telescope with the eye was detected ever since then everything has been detected photographically by taking photographs and studying those images and being able to find even fainter moons but the this was the last one back in the late 1800s that was then detected uh, uh, by just looking through a telescope much as the way as Galileo detected the lar four large moons of Jupiter uh, centuries before. So that was our picture of the day for May 24th of 2023. It was titled Observatory Aligned with Moon Occulting Jupiter. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture previewed to be in a cat's eye. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.